72 volt 10 amp hour life bat batteries. That's one here and one where the radiator used to go. We have the Agni motor. When we get to the other side, you'll see the, the sprocket and the drive system that we've got at the moment. And at the back, we're currently evaluating the, the Kelly controller. So this is a Kelly controller rated at 600 amps. With the belt drive, we need quite a wide pulley to transmit the power and the torque. So at the moment we're just going with a, a standard sprocket and pulley um, with a belt. Uh, that's the Agni motor there. Um, we're supporting it on this outrigger bearing so that we can take the forces imposed by the chain tension and the torque reaction. And some of the aspects you see are relatively crude, but you must appreciate this is a development vehicle. So at the moment we're using it just to find out what's happening and what's going on and then we will make sure for the final vehicle we have a much more finalised design that looks, looks more substantial. System, so we can do some initial testing on our rolling road chassis dynamometer at Kingston and take the measurements of current draw, temperatures, um, charge times, discharge times, make sure all the mechanicals hold it together before we actually take it to the track which will be taking place in February. One of the key things for our success was to make sure we secured good sponsors. Um, we managed to secure sponsorship from LifeBat in terms of batteries, monitoring systems and battery monitors. Also sponsorship from other companies, um, cash sponsorship from companies such as Vipro and Sweltrack who look after Transport for London. Um, and also sponsorship from Agni Motors who currently supplies with the motor. Bow, 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 bow. 